Lashes to lashes, busted to dusted. This is the church of Glam Jesus, and in foundation we've trusted. Amen, honey. You guys always gonna be this close? I look really cute. Oh, I look really cute on camera. This bad. But I haven't seen myself on camera yet. We cannot be red for our legs. There, there. <laughs> is it the shoulders up? Is it the shoulders, shoulders up? <laughs> Alright. Oh, oh, oh god. Guess you Good. Welcome to RuPaul's Drag Race. The countdown begins now. 30 minutes to do your makeup, bitches. Is it going? Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh. <laughs> you know this shit isn't gonna not set. Oh, I'm bleeding somewhere. Damn, this is gonna be a 30 minute affair right here. No. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Is this a drag rag or no? Huh? Can I touch this rag? No, no, no. I won't. I can get you it. Actually, do though. I always wondered why it was so big. <sighs> Doing your makeup in 30 minutes is not the easiest thing. But you're gonna make it work today. Isn't that right? Miss Luna. Okay, you're talking to yourself again. Oh, okay, no, no, no. When I'm fully prepared, it's you asking me for my makeup. She came on the show and wasn't fully prepared. I don't even know what your shoes. Alexandra. Never been anyway. Looking for one blush. That didn't even help her busted face look good. <laughs> Sabotage. I'm just doing it to your shirt. Girl, look how motherfucking orange I look. <laughs> <laughs> I do look really orange though. Okay, but it's this yellow lighting. Doesn't work well for my complexion. I looked at that ice cream. <laughs> you mean Neapolitan? Yes, that one. <laughs> Bitch doesn't even know her own joke. <laughs> <laughs> the cameraman's getting involved. Don't use my neck as like a <laughs> bitch. I hope that is not where the powder is. What should my cameraman name me? Oh, I'm sorry. Hi, Shadow Potion. Now available at Sephora. <laughs> Do you have a product endorsement, Miss Alexandra? Well, but you don't have the shit pink. I'll, I'll let you know when I get to my eyes. Ooh. That drag rag came in handy. 23 minutes remaining! How are queens doing? Really good, I'm feeling very confident with the time. I think I'll have time just to take a shit afterwards. Oh Miss Luna? I'm good. My eyes bothering me. My eyes getting red. I know, Luna's looking a little troubled. Where am I? Oh, yeah, I don't know where to put it. This bitch. Okay, I need to start organizing this bag. You can't organize this bag. I, I need to start organizing this bag. The competition is really getting down to the wire. Only 13 minutes and 50 seconds remain here on RuPaul's Drag Race. So as you can see, queens are starting to get desperate. Aw, oh, fuck. Just fuck that shit up. <laughs> I got it. Last 
Still don't got control of the sweating problem. I think I'm ready for the competition. I've been ready for a long time. Five, four, three, two, one. Time. Hands up. We all got hands. Don't, don't let them see us. I know. <laughs> you got that? Like, you gotta wait till the end of you. Who are you and why should you be on RuPaul's Drag Race? My name is Alexandra McQueef and I should be on RuPaul's Drag Race because I've seen all these bitches. I've seen what they can do and I'm not impressed. That's why I'm gonna take the show to a new level. An Alexandra level. A sluttier level. Can you introduce yourself and tell us why you should be on RuPaul's Drag Race? Yes, hi. Uh, my name is Luna Soul. I'm 21 years old. I I don't know where I live right now. Who cares? But uh, uh, why I think I should be on Drag Race? Good question. Uh, I want a challenge. I like challenges. I like challenging my day, every day. Everybody needs a good challenge, and this is the next level, and that's a good challenge. What kind of performer are you? I'm the kind of performer that conforms to whatever her master wants. You want me down and dirty, and I'll give you down and dirty. You want me prim and proper, and girl, there's no other. Uh, I'm more comedy based. Uh, I can read like no other. I, I'm pretty good at comedy. Uh, I'm pretty good actor. Can do some acting. I've done some acting. Can you give us a read? Uh, not on camera. I have no one to read but you and honey. I don't need to. Can you tell us anything about your competitor, Luna Soul? But to be honest, Luna Soul is a little bitch who can't read a bitch or anything. I'm not a competitor. What competitor? That's all I have to say. Yeah, she's a, she's a great queen. She's been there a lot in my career, and we've learned and grown very well together, and it's, it's great to be here with her. No shade to throw during no. the interview. And if you won this competition, what would you do with that $100,000? If I won this competition, I would pay off all of my student loan debt because it's crippling to me and I really need this money. Do you have any final send off for any Alexandra McQueef fans? All my little McQueefies. I love you so much. Keep queefing. <laughs> to be honest, I would probably go buy some makeup, obviously. But uh, I would probably help some charities. There's a lot of great things out there. Uh, I'd probably have to put myself through what I've always wanted was makeup school. I want to help other people look this good, not just myself. Giving back. Any final words to say to any Luna Soul fans out there? Keep it solely. Keep it solely? Yeah, they know what it means. Go home, bitch! I want it! <laughs> Boom! How was that? I already got the crown. Was it good? Yeah. Bob, what do you think? Was it good? Was it good, Bob? I think it was the best darn thing I've ever seen. Oh. No lies. <laughs> Where are you? Where are you? I can be a pageant. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Woo! I am excited to see the results of this. And I kind of just made a name for my fans. Okay! I'll find my breakthrough role. This is the birth of Luna Soul. Bitch! I still fell off, bitch. Little man will eat this shit out of me. Uh, I know. I dropped them at first. You should see my face. I was like, no. Can we keep watching more? That's so exciting. Woo!